Once upon a time, the oceans and the seas were blue, beautiful shades of blue. The waves would flow and the little fishermen would build boats to be able to admire the beauty and do some fishing. But with time, with time, the plastic that came into our world was being thrown into the rivers, into the sea, and it was growing. Hence, the fish boats had to change into recollectors of plastic and recyclers of plastic. But the plastic, islands and trash were growing and growing, taller and bigger, like the garbage patch on the Pacific Ocean. Take, for example, the plastic that one person throws per year and the people around if we add up all that plastic it's growing and growing and then those people have offspring and future generations increasing that amount of plastic still throwing more and more and more into the environment which always ends up in the sea because it's a blue planet and those generations Obviously, they learn from their elders and they learn that that's the way they do things. And the plastic is growing and spreading all over the ocean. It's so sad, from oil to all types of bottles and garbage. And it's the plastic is spreading all over the ocean and it's turning into little micro particles which are eaten by sea creatures, thinking that that is what they have to eat. But what if we teach how to recycle plastic? People in different parts of the world showing that we can build sculptures, we can build from verandas to pipelines to all sorts of recycling, even making jewellery like little bracelets from recycled plastic. It's not a question of raising funds to clear other people's wastes. It's really a question of education. If we don't throw it away in the first place, we learn how to recycle, we learn how to respect, we learn how this affects the environment, we can change the homeostasis of planet. We can actually do something for the planet.